The first thing I need to do is remove all the stains from the pavers. I noticed a few rust marks on the pavers, so I'm going to use the rust remover from Technoseal to take care of these. Let me show you how it's done. Here's a couple of rust stains that I'm going to show you how to remove. Whenever using the cleaning agent, you always want to wear a pair of protective gloves. You want to pre-wet the pavers and then apply the product directly to the stain. You can see the two rust marks right here. You can see it start to react on the rust and then you simply want to scrub it. You can see it coming out and you want to rinse thoroughly. I have some moss stains here that I'm going to use the organic stain remover from Technosil. This product is also good on bird droppings, grass stains, leaf stains, blood, ketchup, any type of organic based stain. You simply dilute the product inside of a watering can and then just directly pour it onto your stain. You want to let it work for a few seconds and then scrub. So this was a pretty tough stain here, so I had to apply the product a couple of times. You just want to make sure that you rinse thoroughly all the product until it's gone. As you can see, our stains are gone now. I have a couple of paint drippings here that I'm going to remove with the Technoseal Paint Tar and Rubber Remover. This product is also good for tire marks, gum, and any type of bitumen. It's a direct pour product that you pour directly onto the stain. And then you just let it sit and it'll work. It could take up to two or three hours for this product to work, depending on the severity of the stain. Before I seal these pavers, I need to clean the entire area. Technoseal offers two different products to accomplish this. They have the hardscape cleaner for general maintenance of previously sealed surfaces and general cleanup, and they have the paver primer efflorescence cleaner for newer installed pavers. I'm going to use this product today to clean the entire area because there are signs of efflorescence and it's very dirty. Let me show you how it's done. The easiest way to apply this product is by using the Technoseal sprayer. You simply attach a regular garden hose to the nozzle and connect it to your bottle. As you can see, there's lots of efflorescence and ground in dirt on these pavers, so let me show you how to clean it. I'm going to set this to the B setting for the 4 to 1 dilution ratio that is recommended, and then I'm going to apply it thoroughly and evenly to ensure that there's no dry spots. One bottle will clean approximately 200 square feet. If you don't have a Technoseal sprayer, simply mix the product in a watering can at a 4 to 1 dilution ratio and apply it thoroughly without leaving any dry spots. You want to take a broom and move the product around, distributing it evenly throughout your project. This will help loosen any ground in dirt. Now you want to rinse thoroughly without letting the product dry on the surface. 